Okay. So this will be a seated stretching class that you can do at your desk, at your computer. And if you have a towel or you can somehow find just something you can grab onto for some support, you will use that as well. But this is an attempt to give you something to do throughout the day um, that you're able to just take a moment from work and, and help the shoulders, help the low back, the hips and the arms. And it will only be about not even, not even 10 minutes. So thanks for doing it. And we'll get started right now. Just seating yourself here, nice and think about like your posture. You're nice and tall because so so often throughout the day we're here to hear, so just sit up nice and tall. And all that you're gonna do to begin is a big breath in, feel the shoulders pull back, and then a big breath out, let the shoulders sink down again. So just think inhaling, pulling the shoulders back, bringing the chest out, and then exhaling, let it go. Just do that one more time. Big breath in, open, and then exhale, let it go. And now bring the hands up right and just right in front of your chest, shake them out, shake them out, and then make a fist. And then do that just a couple more times. So you're just shaking out the hands and then make a fist and then shake it out, shake it out, make a fist, just getting that movement one more time, shake it out and then make that fist. Good. And then shake it out. And we're going to clasp the hands together here. So bringing the palms in front, reach, feel the arm stretch and lengthen out. And from this position, all that you're going to do is a little movement side to side. So keeping your chest and upper body open, just do a little movement, twisting with that left side, dropping the shoulder down, bring it back to your center position, and then take it over that right side. So we're just getting a little mobility in throughout the side part of your torso, sitting, still sitting up nice and tall, and then come back into your center, bring the palms down, bring the hands down, shake it out, shake it out, and now clasp the fingertips this forward way so the wrists are stretching out now in front of you. And now do the same thing where all you're gonna do is sit up tall and then take the movement slightly over that left side. So rotating through the side part of your body, good. And then slowly bring it back to your center and then go to that right side. Just trying to get some movement into that side and take a nice inhale, take a nice exhale, bring yourself back into your center position. Beautiful. And then drop those hands down again, shake it out, shake it out. We're now going to implement that towel. So if you don't have it, that's okay. Pretend like you do, but grabbing, if you have it to the sides of it, so extend your arms up, reach. So you're pulling against the towel. And again, if you don't have it, just pretend like you've got something you're holding some tension against here. Now, slowly take the arms, lift them up over your head. As you're doing it, drop your chin to your chest and imagine the arms are pulling back. Like if I were standing there in person behind the desk and I'm trying to gently pull your shoulders back as your head drops down, it doesn't have to be a huge range of motion, just whatever you can do. And then slowly as they're come, as the arms are coming back down, we're lifting the head up and then feeling the neck open up, feeling the chin open up. And then repeat that. We're going to do that two more times. So the arms start stretching up right here above the chest, the collarbone, pulling back or imagine you're pulling back on some tension. And then as the arms reach up, the head drops down. Reach, reach, reach. Lengthening out, just trying to do something nice for the back of the head, back of the neck and feel the shoulders pull back. And then slowly let the arms come down, let the head lift up. Breathing in, breathing out one more time. Bring it down arms right in front, and then start that lift. As you're doing that lift, the head drops down, feeling the back of the neck flexors, hopefully disengage a little bit. And then just breathe in, breathe out. You're doing awesome. And now slowly, but surely bring it back on down again. Good, good job. And then go ahead, relax the hands, do that little shake out. We're gonna, before we grab the towel for the next one, we're gonna bring the arms from this position right here straight up. So reach the arms straight up overhead. And then from here, Go ahead, drop the head down again, just how we had it before. Try to pull the arms back a little bit further behind you if you can, and then slowly let the head come back up. Extend the arms out wide, make sure you're not gonna hit anything. Reach, reach, reach. And now we'll bring the arms in right in front of you. And then just drop the arms back down again. Shake it out, shake it out. So one more of those. We're just trying to get some expansion and just trying to open up the shoulders a little bit more, a little bit differently. So from here, go ahead, bring the arms back up. Reach, reach, reach. Let the head drop down, do a little chin to chest and then lift up and then bring the arms circle back down to your sides and then flip so the palms face inward like you're about to high five, bring in and then just let the arms drop, drop straight down and then grab the towel again if you've got it. We're gonna take the arms up with the towel this time. This movement now we're bending the elbows so pulling back against that tension and then do that little twist side to side again. So we're hopefully a little warmer now so a little twist the right side. Bring it back center, a little twist the left side. 
you're doing awesome. Bring it back to your center. You're doing great. Just breathe and then take the arms and extend, lift them up, reach, 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 and then lower back down. Two more, just feeling that pull. And it's a little bit, a little bit of stuff for the shoulders massed in here, right back down. One more time, breathe, reach, reach, reach. And then exhale, let it go. No more towel, good job, shake out the hands. Maybe you wanna bring the towel behind your head, that's fine. Um, we can take now and bring the right palm on top of your head and then just slowly drop over to that right shoulder. And this left hand, if you're, if you're able to sit on it, so you're just gonna force this left shoulder to drop down as you're stretching. Take a breath in, take a breath out. Bring yourself back to your center. Now move where your hand is, literally grip now, close to the back of your skull, back of your head. Elbow is going to pull in and then drop the elbow down. Drop the chin and chest, just feeling the neck again. Taking an inhale, giving yourself credit for doing this because I know even this, this alone is not easy. Take that exhale, open it back up and then drop it down. And now we'll do the same thing with the left side. So take your left palm on top of your head and then slowly pull over to that left side. Good. And then again, if you want to sit on that right hand here, you can just to help that shoulder drop down. Take a nice inhale, take a nice exhale, and then come back to your center. And now move the hand closer to the back of your head, pull the elbow in. And so as we're dropping down the back, that shoulder is going to track straight down with you. And then just breathe, breathe, breathe easy again. Taking a nice inhale, taking a nice exhale, let it go. And then now we're going to slowly round up again, bring it up. And then let that arm fall out to the side, drop it down, drop it down. And now take both of your hands. So we did this one um, earlier. We're going to clasp the hands together, reach the palms into this stretch. So you're stretching out through the wrists. And from here, take the arms up, just an up a little bit, and then lower down a little bit. So thinking about from the backs of your shoulder sockets, just lifting up, reach, 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 and then back down. One more time with the hands like this. Breathe, lift up, lift up, lower down, and then flip the palms again, lengthen up this way. And then do that lift and then that lower. Good. It's just to get some shoulder work, some arm stretched, stretch work out. Like imagine you're being pulled apart from the front where the tops of those shoulders connect in to your collarbone. Two more. Good job. One more. And then hands are going to come behind the head after this. So shake it out, shake it out. Bring the hands behind your head. Think about the elbows expanding. So you're broadening your chest, broadening the collarbone. Open. Breathe, feel the shoulder blades pull back, feel the chest expand. And then as you close, you're not closing. Essentially, we're rounding in the upper back, elbows come in, round through the upper back, breathe, and then reopen it back. Feel the chest expand, big breath in, big breath out, and then round it back down again. Good job. And then lift up, let the hands just come to your sides and just roll your neck out to the right side. This is for five. Good head rolls for four. Three, nice job. Two and one, and then take it the other way. So just rolling it out for five, for four, three, two, and there is your one. Good job. We're going to finish this with a nice inhale, nice exhale. So shake out the hands last time. Do a little shake out from the fingertips and then try to broaden the arms, reach the shoulders up, reach the fingertips up and around, palms expand, expand towards the sky. Let it go. Final one right here. Big breath in, reach up. Everything lengthen up through the spine, sit up nice and tall. And then exhale, let it go. That is it. You did wonderful. You did an amazing job. And just hope you have a nice rest of your day. That's all. All right, bye.